talk to me um today i'm back again with um a couple of very interesting thing about building in ghana that i want to talk to you guys about yeah last time i spoke to you guys about the how much it cost um for where we were um i think that was my second video yes second video of building in ghana so um i told you guys from the foundation uh, to the superstructure we spent twenty nine thousand. um i'll show you guys about that one um i made a video about that you can go back and watch that video i think it's, it's gonna be either up on the left or right up there somewhere but today i'm making this video to give you guys specific cost of everything because the thing is if you are in abroad and somebody building for you in ghana they can tell you oh cement is this amount or sun is this amount or rocks is this amount or whatever but if you have an idea how much one trip of a um, sun cost or rock cost and even though if the prices go high you will still have an idea how much it cost because trust me ghana they will rip you off they will like i keep on saying saying the same thing again you will ask somebody to build your house for you if you don't find somebody that you can trust when you have your land and you started giving them money to buy i mean to build your house for you they will use some of your money to buy their land or maybe they have land already so they're building your house and they're building their house so sometimes they will finish their house before you finish your house so seriously guys be serious about that because Ghanaians, we are not all of us not all of us because mr akumia boatin is awesome awesome you won't believe what he does everything here from cement to sun to the truck that brings the uh, blocks how much blocks he buys everything he write it down he calculated and he sent it to us i mean what, what am i going to do to this what am i going to do with this man he's a blessing and some of you are asking me if i can show his information and things he said no no now no 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 like forever no but no now so guys wait and see what he is doing with my our house and then you're gonna have Ghanaians to say vim to say like yeah he can do it and so today the video is about how much it costs for everything that no how much it costs for the foundation alone the foundation alone i'm gonna give you guys list by list how much everything costs and so that you can have an idea how things cost in ghana when you are building nobody will, somebody will call you and say oh brother it says uh, some one um truck or what do you call it the this um the tipper truck the one that brings <laughs> the sun with oh, this much i'm gonna give you an idea so that when you are talking to somebody in ghana about your house or your building you can say oh i thought they said it cost this much so if at least it's gone up it shouldn't be this so you have an idea so hold on for this so like i said we bought um two tracks of chip chippings one is 1800 ghana city 
So two was 3,600. Um, two son of truck, 900 a truck, 1,800 for the two. Gravels, four trucks, six, 600 Ghana City. So the four was 24 Ghana, 2400 Ghana City. Um, we bought two wheelbarrows, 200 each. So the two was 400. Um, carpenter work, work uh, was 120 Ghana City. We bought cement. Um, we bought 170 cement. 170 pieces of cement. And that was, um, one was 38 Ghana City. I know I think it went up, but this is an idea. Um, 170 pieces of cement. We bought um, 3,000 um, blocks. 3,000 blocks. Um, crit uh, blocks. Um, that was a very good blocks. Strong blocks. Um, we bought um, all this. We pay labor for the car, for the for the truck. No, for uh, labor, one hundred and fifty Ghana City. We bought iron rods, um, sixteen mm iron rods was um, three thousand four hundred and fifty. Twelve mm iron rods. 3450 Ghana City. We bought um, three by eight iron rods, 100 pieces, seven, seven cities a piece, 700 Ghana City for the hundred. Um, we bought a um, bundle of wire, uh, two. One was 40 Ghana City, so 280 Ghana City. We bought board, four by a uh, two by four board. It was um, we bought 20. It was 27 Ghana City, so um, 540 Ghana City for the 20. Wawa board one by 12. Um, we bought 40, 50 Ghana City a piece, so 2,000 for the 40. Redwood two by two. 20 pieces, 15 Ghana City, 300 um, Ghana City for the 20. We bought three inches nails. We bought um, two inches nails. Everything, uh, the nails are 50 Ghana City, 50 Ghana City. And transport for the wood to the site was 150 Ghana City. And then we, and then we bought, um, Two tanks of water. The water was uh, 140. So we bought two. With the transport and everything was um, um, 400 Ghana City. We bought a one by 12 carbon board, 20 pieces, 28, 28 Ghana City each, and the 20 was 560. We bought three inches nails. Four inches nails, uh, one every each of one is fifty Ghana CD. Um, yeah, so this is all that we bought. And after we finish the foundation, then we have to fill the foundation up. And first of all, our foundation was very high. He advised us that we should build the foundation high in case there's a rain or whatever uh, in the in the area. Our our uh, building will be way up there and again he advised us that sometimes when this road in front of you is not built and uh, you don't raise your foundation when you are building and you don't raise your foundation as soon as they do they finish the road in front in front of your house your house look like it's way down and the, the street is higher than your house so he advised us to build a foundation higher. So our foundation is really, really high. And we, we we thank him so much for telling us that because June, when we built this foundation on in May, uh, by June, it did rain 
and the rain was like all over the place and it wasn't like a flooded area it's not a flooded area but the rain was so high and uh, our house was like just the water is just passed by it like it's nothing so that's good because if a neighbor who doesn't have that much gutters gutters to consume a uh, rain it caused the area to be flooded but our area is good. So we bought um, red sand to fill the foundation. We bought 23 um, trucks. Um, yes, and it, one was 550 Ghana CD. So 23 was um, trucks was 12,650 Ghana CD. And that was that. And the labor, those who fill the, the foundation with the with the the red sand they charge every track or um, trip um, every one i don't even know uh, do you call it track or trip trip the the cement the red sand they charge it they, when they put it in they charge 120 ghana city so 120 times uh, 23 was uh, 2760 ghana city so that's how much um, the piece uh, of the price of everything. I think I didn't mention everything, but everything in all, the foundation cost us 12,000 USD, 12,000, uh, no, 12,000 US dollars for the foundation. And like I said, our foundation is high. So um, that that's how much it costs. And, uh, we are happy with it because we know people that have built and they it costs way more than that. So we are blessed and we are happy with it that. And like I said, um he knows what he's doing and he's been building for so many years. So we are happy to have him and I pray that you guys will find somebody that will do you guys good because building in Ghana is not that hard and it's not that expensive but it all depends who is doing it for you because like I always said in I said in my other video they will build their house they will use your money if they don't have money um, they don't have land already they will use part of your money and uh, to buy a land and when they are building your house they are building their house also probably they will even finish their house before you finish your house so be wise and be let your eyes be open that's why i'm doing this video i have watched a lot of videos on youtube before we started building so i am really serious about making these videos because at least you will catch something out of this video because i did i did get a lot of knowledge from watching a lot of youtube videos i love youtube anyway so i get a lot of um knowledge from YouTube videos and this guy that I'm uh, is helping us he's uh, our contractor and he has to go through uh, Mr. Akumia Boatin before anything else and he was charging us 8,000 Ghana CD to do something and Mr. Akumia Boatin was like what? Saying that because you know how much it costs to um, do the Ghana CD you think I will let them pay that? So like I said, we are so grateful and thankful that um, he's doing all this for us. So thank you guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much. And thank you for those who um, have already subscribed to my channel. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Um, please subscribe. And like I said, we I'm taking you guys to um, with me to this journey of building our house, our dream home in Ghana. So subscribe, 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 please. And um, give me a thumbs up and hit the notification bell so that anytime I post a video, you can watch it. Thank you so much. I love YouTube. I watch YouTube like, I don't even turn my television on. So YouTube is my friend, so please subscribe. Thanks a lot. Bye.